Hello everybody, it is Prodigy Queen again, and in this Prodigy video, I'm going to be showing you how to get the awesome water element fishbowl pet in Prodigy. Now, this fishbowl pet I first thought was unobtainable, but then, when I wanted to catch an aqua riot, I just went to, to the place and I found a fishbowl instead. So, Prodigy actually updated these pets, so they actually look kind of similar now, and you cannot probably tell the difference, but the fishbowl has these two, like, corkscrews at the top of him, and two eyes, it looks kind of cute. And it has 11,628 health at level 100. It evolves into the aqua riot, which now... Is, is which now is this weird thing with three eyes and it's not that cute and it has the same amount of health so this is a bonus video so i'm going to be showing you the, dis the the description too so i'm going to go ahead and find the description for these bad boys so there's the fishbowl it's a water type element as i was saying earlier and fishbowls tend to stay away from extreme heat if the water inside them reaches the boiling point their cork like plugs could pop straight out like i was saying these are these these are corkscrews so um so i'm guessing how it attacks is that it like lifted the corkscrews and, and then the, the torrent comes through or whatever spell so today i'm going to be showing you how to catch this pet so the first thing you want to do is you want to go to the world map and head over to shipwreck shore the next thing you want to do is you want to head over to the right which is near the seashell over here and then what you want to do is you want to battle this muckster or which, whichever pet's over here for you. Mainly it's a muckster or a truckle. And then, or a trip trap. And then you want to go up here. And so I'm going to go ahead and battle this pet. So, and I'll be right back from that battle. So let's get, get this bad boy's attention. So you can wipe my face off and I'll be right back from that battle. feel like you want to go down into the chapter, I don't think you can. You can just remember going to this party cannon looking thing, which I don't think is a party cannon, but I like to call it one since it looks a lot like one. It, it could be like a bomb cannon or something. So you, anyway, you want to head over to it, and then you can remember to go straight up. So you're going to see this screen when you're done doing that. And now what you want to do is you want to head up this path. So before, when I was just beginning Prodigy, I thought you had to battle this muckster to get up. But that's not true. If you if you can't remember to just go up here and go here, what you could do is just remember to go to this party cannon and go straight up from the party cannon. Okay, so then what you want to do is you want to head over to this whirlpool over here. But in order to do that, we have to battle a truckle. I've actually learned how to skip both these pets. So what you want to do is, do you see this mast right over here? You want to go straight over to the mast, like this like this bird's nest over here of the ship. Like the bird's nest is like the very lookout area of a ship. And you want to head straight right after you do that. And then you can voila, and then you can just go over here and boom, we just passed that. Two pets in a row. And now what we have to do is we have to battle the truckle since we, we cannot skip that pet, as you can see over here. So I'm going to go ahead and battle this truckle. It's going to poke me with its horn and stab it. Okay, I'll, anyway guys, I'm going to be right back from this battle. Okay guys, so I finished battling that trickle over there, trickle, and now we can head over into this whirlpool over here. And now we're going to see this screen with this jelly gym guy over here. So what we want to do is we want to head over into this sand pit, but if there's a bunch of black clouds or black ink over it, then what you have to do is go to the path that I'm going to show you. But if this is uncovered like, like mine's is, you can always just skip ahead from the video. So I'm going to go ahead and battle this pet so, we, so I can go ahead and show you how to go up and where we're supposed to go. So... 
Uh, let, let's let's click on the pet so we can get it get this depressed guy's attention. He looks so depressed. Oh, I'm gonna comfort you down by battling you. Yeah, he ripped my head off. Boo. Okay, so I'm I'm gonna be right back from this battle. All right, guys. So now that we're back from that river neek battle. I'm going to be showing you how to take the path if your path over here is blocked with some ink. So you're going to go up here and you're going to see a river neek, but we don't want to battle that pet. So we can just go straight into the seaweed down here and skip that pet. Now we're going to see two pets over here. So in order to skip both of them, we want to go down into this long seaweed over here and go to the orange one, then go here, and then we want to head straight up to this to this purple light orb tree over here. So let's go over there. And now what we want to do is we can just sneak right onto this seashell, well, whatever, seashell design, and boom, we're past both pets. Okay, so this is the spot you end up when you battle all those pets. So you should stop here when you when if you had the path blocked. And so now let's continue the rest of the video. So this is the spot where you will find a fishbowl or you'll perhaps find an aquarius. So I'm going to go ahead and keep refreshing the page since I do not see an aquarius or a fishbowl over here. So I'm going to go ahead and refresh the page and I'll be right back from that to see if I got a fishbowl. Alright guys, so I just finished refreshing the page and, you, and as you can see over here, this is a fishbowl. As you can see, those are its two quirks and those are its cute little eyes. And now, let's go ahead and battle with it. So this portion of the video is going to be battling with it. I like the way it moves. It like flies with water behind it. See over here? Boom! It's like shooting with water with its food. So I'm going to go ahead and battle with this pet. So this half, half of the video, once again, is going to be battling with this pet. So he has like, I wonder how he attacks it. His quirks food are probably going to pop out. Let's see. So I'm just going to go ahead and solve this question, which we just got correct. Let's see how this guy attacks after we attack with our volcano spell. Whoa, that was so cool. He's like, ah, I'm so scared. And then boom, a torrent shoots out of him. So... Um, if you, if so far, so, let's see, how much health, oh, uh, wait, 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 what did I just use? Okay, I just used Volcano, and I think, I'm not really sure. As I was, like, going to say, so far, how much, like, potions have we used or something? Mm -hmm. So, Prodigy people have probably actually used, like, um, Prodigy Legends probably have used more than 100 potions in their Prodigy life. So I'm just going to go ahead and use an epic attack now on this cool pet. So I'm just going to go ahead and solve this question. Alright guys, so I finished solving the question and I got a cute little badge along with it. So I'm going to go ahead and collect the badge. So now we're switching to our Meg Mischief and using our epic attacks. Strangely, Meg Mischief seems, seems to be sick and sneezing. Huh? Uh? Achoo! There, that's him sneezing in. Ah, I'm all covered in snot. See, since he's like right opposed from me. Now he's covering me in lava. Help, it's so hot. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and use Volcano. The reason Meg Mischief is sick because he's cast too many good spells. And now he's casting bad, like 3,000 damage spells. That's it. So I'm going to do my Trip Drop. Same with the Trip Drop. I think they have crummies in their tummies. So he missed on me, this funkyl. Funkyls are very funky for some reason. So I'm using overgrowth now. And I'm going to go ahead and solve this question, which is really, really easy, in fact. So now we can claim another badge. How many badges am I going to get? It's like I got two in a row, almost. So it's a measurement rank six. Okay. Let's see here. Oh, it's going really, really slowly. Okay. So let's use overgrowth. 5,000 damage! You must be kidding me! Trip Drop has got rid of the crummy tummies in his stomach. So actually, I, I actually did not rescue the pet, so... Because I already have one, that's why I read it in the description. So, members get more stars. Let's claim our 10 member stars, and let's open our member chest. 
All right, guys, so that was how to get the awesome Water Element Fishbowl Pet and Prodigy. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe and the like button and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of these awesome Prodigy videos. And now I'll see you in the next Prodigy video. In the meantime, I'm going to, I'm going to explode in this guy's heat, you know, um, the act the, uh, the fishbowl's heat of its corkscrews when it got so hot. Ah, I'm burning. Anyway, guys, I'll see you in the next Prodigy video now. I'm <laughs> sorry.